I don't know. I know a lot of people and their pets were upset by it, but I don't mind a little rain, some sounds overnight. Some people pay money for those sound machines. <laughs> it's like thunderstorm, go. Go. <laughs> sleep time. A little pitter patter on the <laughs> rooftop. Mother Nature did put on quite a show for the last two nights, and many of you sent us pictures and videos of what you were seeing of the lightning. And that lightning actually came in different colors. New at 630, meteorologist Matt Gray explains why. Matt. Yeah, count me as the people with the lightning, uh, lightning go to sleep mix there at the side of the bed. Here are some pictures I took of the lightning over the past couple of nights. Really was some spectacular stuff. And what we see here, we've got shades of blue, we've got shades of purple, we've got some white, but nowhere do you see yellow, which is what we all crayoned it in as kids in art class. So what is the real color of lightning and why is it not just one color in these pictures? Well, let's take a look. There are three reasons. First, our atmosphere, 78% nitrogen, 21% oxygen, and a little bit of water vapor sprinkled in around thunderstorm time. There's a little bit of hydrogen mixed in too when there's lightning around. So when you hit these elements with a lot of energy, like, I don't know, a lightning strike, they give off these colors. It's mostly blues and reds. Combine those together. You get those little purples and pinks that we see so often in photos around here. And second, like what happens with sunlight, the atmosphere is very good at scattering different colors, including blue, and as the light travels to your eyes. So if the lightning's close by, not much scattering of lights at all, and the bolt is going to be white and very close to you and very scary <laughs> further away and higher in the sky will be blue, just like if, we're, if it were a midday sky far away and low on the horizon, it's going to give off those shades of red and yellow like a sunset. And that brings us to factor number three, temperatures. Not all lightning strikes are the same temperature, and that will affect the color a little bit too. The hotter the bolt is, the more blue or violet or white it will appear. The cooler it is, the more likely it will have that pretty rare yellow, orange, or red hue. So, color of lightning, what exactly is it? Well, white, blue, purple, you can't go wrong with that, and occasionally everything else. No matter what color, though, it's usually a pretty good show.